Today we'll look at how to add a grout model roll to concrete elements in Advanced Steel 2021. I've created a polyline. I'm going to use that just as a reference to create a concrete slab. I'll just specify first corner and second corner. Endpoint to endpoint. Under the naming tab, I want a model roll called grout. So if I look, grout doesn't exist. Very simple. You're going to go to your home tab and from the management tools, you'll go to the object property editor. So we have our model role section here. I'll just expand that fly out and we're going to look for something very, very similar. So let's go up to the concrete. So concrete. So from the concrete category, we have concrete beams, concrete ceiling, concrete foundation. That'll be good enough. So I can create a new model role. And I can call that grout. And I want to apply it to all concrete objects. I'll hit the apply key and go home to my defaults. I want to load settings in advance. And from there, from the project, you're going to update defaults. Again, you can get that from the home tab. You can update defaults from the tools. Tab. I might have to recreate, but let's just see. From the naming panel, I'm going to scroll to the model row and expand the flyout. And if I've done this correctly, should be grout. And there we go. And um, simple, easy peasy. That's how to add a grout model role to a concrete element in advanced steel.